The 400 volt cap bank hasn't been out to play for a while. Time to change that. This incredibly cheap battery powered alarm clock is on the plate for destruction today. It takes one single AAA battery. If I put it in, the alarm goes off, even though the alarm said hand is on the opposite side of the clock face from where the hour hand is. It also doesn't seem to care about the alarm on off switch, but will finally shut up if I press the flashlight button, because that makes complete sense. In second grade, I made the terrible mistake of bringing this to school to show my friends. Instead, the alarm clock went off in my locker while I was still in class. A teacher brought it in, and I was forced to go up to the front while everyone was staring and this thing was still beeping its little head off. As you can imagine, this was very embarrassing for shy little me. And now it's time to have my revenge. little pop, and it's dead short. I ain't having that. Well, I think I found the source of the short circuit. These are the battery terminals. They're not supposed to be connected together like that, but I accidentally spot welded them. Don't know if that's the right polarity, and don't really care. That's pretty well wrecked, but we all know open circuit at 400 volts is by no means open circuit at 2000. Time for some MOT action. Like that. Time for round two. Well, that pretty well sums up what I think of this alarm clock. 